In this video, I am going to show you how to wire up a 12V 5A SMPS. Let's get started. So, I have an SMPS right in my hands. So, this is a 12V 5A SMPS. So, here you can see some markings on it. So, this is the light, neutral and ground. And this is the minus terminal uh, which is the output and this is the plus terminal and here is the adjust potentiometer on which you can adjust it. So now you can see here I have a mains AC code. So this mains AC voltage can kill you. So please do be careful and don't take it very simply. So let's start. So here is the live, live wire so now I'm using a screwdriver to loosen the screws and tighten up those and keep the wires inside so the wire should be short like this if it's long it may cause a short circuit so connect this new wire so here you can see the main cord so in the main cord the L, is L connects to the red wire as you can see so here they mark L and this is the live wire and let's connect the neutral wire and don't forget to tighten them up very tightly and if you tighten them up very loosely then it may, it may cause a short circuit because the wires may come out and finally you need the ground is necessary because if an, if there is any short circuit in this main AC voltage then this housing may cause a shock to you it may ca cause an electric shock to you so let's I'm removing the screw and tightening up the ground pin as you can see and it is better to have a multimeter set in to con on to continuity to check whether whether uh, there is a short circuit on, on the main score so there is no short circuit now when I touch the pro those two probes makes a noise so nothing so now let's move on to DC and make sure you you uncoil the wires fully and now let's move on to DC and here's the DC wire and you need to connect on to the voltage minus so as you can see this point so in this screw terminal you need to pl plug this minus terminal onto it and tighten it up and the same thing you, you, you can do it to the plus terminal at here and now can I, and here's the adjusting potentiometer where you can use a screwdriver to adjust the voltage so I've set to 14 volt which is the maximum of this and make sure your coil is unkind fully as you can see here so thank you for watching, I will upload something new and if you want any, any videos like this then please do comment on my videos so that I will upload on a new video and don't forget to like, share and subscribe, maybe also comment, stay creative and I will see you next time, bye bye.